Former Liberal MP Dave Sharma is set to return to federal politics after winning a Senate position vacated by former Defence Minister Maurice Payne. Julia Bradley has the latest from Sydney. Julia, good evening. The result was decided only moments ago. It was, Janie, so a big moment for the Liberal Party. We've just had confirmation in the last few moments that that vote has now been finalised. Dave Sharma has been the successful candidate to fill this Senate position, which has been vacated by the former Defence Minister, Maurice Payne. Now, the vote was as follows. Uh, the ballot, the final ballot, he beat out Andrew Constance. The final ballot, 251 to 206. He beat out Andrew Constance, who was considered to be the front runner in this race. I'm told that the uh, Conservative pick, former government minister under Scott Morrison, Zed Seselja, came in third in this ballot. We've already had some reaction to this in the last few moments. It was a win for the moderates, the moderates were one and two, but it is a broad party and all of the candidates were simply outstanding. I'm very pleased because they need someone who can stand up to Penny Wong. He wasn't the person I voted for number one, but I do know him and he will be an excellent senator. So this is a big win for Dave Sharma. It means he will be returning to federal politics. This, of course, after he lost his seat of Wentworth to Teal Independent Allegra Spender at the last federal election. We're also told that uh, power broker Alex Hawke helped to ultimately swing this result for Dave Sharma. In the last few minutes, I've also spoken with New South Wales Liberal MP Damien Chudhope, and he's provided reaction to today's result. This is interesting because his daughter, Monica Chudhope, who was also a staffer for the former New South Wales Premier, uh, Dominic Perrottet, was also running. She was one of nine candidates in this race for this Senate position. He expressed disappointment that she wasn't able to secure this win, uh, given that she had the backing from the head of the Business Council. But ultimately, he said he was happy with this decision. And that seems to be uh, the reaction among the people that we've spoken to in the last few moments. Happy with this decision, this win for Dave Sharma, a big one for Dave Sharma. It certainly is. Julia Bradley, live in Sydney, thank you very much for updating us.